this is the farm by Yao Miro, and this painting was owned by Ernest Hemingway. This painting is often described as detailist because of the minute inventory of the rural world that the artist undertook in painting it. As we look at it, there's just incredible amounts of information added to the painting. was born in Barcelona in 1893 and grew up in a middle-class family. By his 20s, he was painting in Paris at a time when surrealism was in vogue. He was certainly allied with the movement, but he never wanted to be part of any movement. He lived during very tumultuous times as he witnessed both world wars, the Spanish Civil War, and Franco's totalitarian regime. As a result, his work strove for a freedom of expression of the avant-garde. Hoping to cast off old traditions, Miro relentlessly pushed the limits of representation. Miro's work is filled with symbols, including birds, women, and the stars. The ceiling of his bedroom was full of painted stars. His work has been interpreted as a recreation of the child life. That's the Miro sculpture. Isn't that big? It's called the Moonbird. Amazing sculpture, man. He developed these huge sizes to be able to have direct connections with the people on the streets and be part of the city where he was so happy, New York. <laughs> 